All right. Israeli jets have just struck a number of Hamas targets in the Gaza Strip. The airstrikes hit an underground Hamas terror tunnel, as well as two naval vessels belonging to the terror group. The IDF says these measures are in response to yesterday's incident on the Gaza border, in which a group of Palestinians infiltrated the security fence and set fire to an abandoned IDF post. The army has issued a statement condemning Hamas for continuing to funnel its resources into terror against the Jewish state. This round of airstrikes follows Israel's policy that Hamas is to blame for any and all aggression in the Strip. Palestinians have also continued to fly firebombs over the border using homemade kites, often setting Israeli fields ablaze during an already dry summer season. Still, this unrest in the Strip has boiled over in recent months, climaxing with the opening of the new U.S. Embassy in Jerusalem last week. The Hamas bomb sponsored March of Return protests along the border sparked a six-week epidemic of attempted terror attacks and infiltration along the border. Hamas allegedly scaled back the violence in exchange for a softened retaliation from the IDF. This latest exchange of fire is a reminder that those tensions have clearly still yet to come.